The FIFA 20 demo has been released. It got dropped today about two hours ago, roughly sometime like that. Um, and I know what a lot of you are thinking. All we have is Volta in kickoff. Yep, it kind of can get a little bit boring repetitively playing the same thing by yourself over and over and over again, especially the Volta thing. Uh, I believe that you get like a small snippet of the story mode and then that's it. Um, and with kickoff, I believe you get the UCL... Uh, package which is like the group stage semi-finals finals which again can be pretty boring so what i'm gonna do today is show you guys how you can play against your friends without being in the same place as them i guess uh i've got a friend who ironically lives downstairs from me um nerdfire who's gonna be helping me uh show you guys today how you can actually play against your friends online on the FIFA 20 demo. Now, this is only on PlayStation. I don't know how to do it on Xbox because I don't think there's share play on Xbox. Um, so, yeah. It's super simple. All you need to do is go on to kickoff. And when you're on side select, you want to uh, press the PlayStation home button. Go up to party. That should have your friend in the party. As you can see, I've got two friends in the party. And then you want to click on share play. Um, and then you want to click on start share play. Now, you need a good connection for this. If you've got a poor connection, not only is it not going to work, but it's going to be a poor experience for the people that are playing as well. So, what you want to do is you want to go and share play and as you see nerdfire join the share play straight away which means that they're connecting to my playstation via share play they don't have to have the demo downloaded as well uh they can play just via share play but it would also help if they had the demo downloaded and once they're connected via share play click on share play again and they say give controller to visitor uh and then you can do either allow the player to play as you or play a game together you want to click on play game together so you have multiple controllers um so I can have a controller, he can have a controller. And then we're on this screen, and as you see, play two is Nerdfire, play one is me, and he's playing via his PlayStation, and I am playing via my PlayStation, which means we can go into a game and play against each other online. Now, the connection's not always great for the other player, unfortunately. It's a little bit ropes. Uh, it can be um, a little bit laggy sometimes or a little bit delayed, but it's the best you can get until the full game comes out, and it's manageable. If you have a good connection, it is manageable. You can deal with it. Um, it's it's not impossible to deal with if you have a good connection on your uh, on your home internet um, and ultimately just wh whoever's got the best connection on their home internet just play on their internet and and that'll help it doesn't matter how far away you are in terms of if you are in the same country at least um, but I know if you if one of you's in America and one of you's in the UK it's, it, the connection is going to be absolutely awful but that's essentially how to do it if you guys uh, found this video useful make sure you leave a like down below subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here thank you for watching and I'll see you later